It's 4.52 in the morning, and I'm going to work at 4.52 in the morning. And I assure you, when I get home from work, I'm going to take a nap. That is Agenda 1. I say good day, sir. I say good day, sir. It's not so bad being up this early in the morning. The good thing about opening at my store, your, uh, your day ends at pretty early, at 1.30. Which is really cool. So you got like the rest of the day to do whatever. But... So it's it's not it's not extremely bad to be up this early. It's just hard to get up and get moving, you know. Like I'm a major procrastinator, and I uh, I'm a I'm a snooze button Nazi. I I constantly like I always set the alarm clock way early, and then just keep hitting the snooze button until I start getting into dangerous territory. And I end up, like, only giving myself ten minutes to get ready and take a shower and all that stuff. But, it's alright. It's a very lonely time, uh, like, getting up this early. Because there's not much traffic, like, there's not a lot of people out. It's just you and one other person at the store, and it's just... It's kind of eerie. It's scary. So what if something were to happen to you and no one would know? Yeah, okay. This is me on lunch. Anywho. So this morning I went and I, uh, I picked, well, I like, my nose has been bothering me all morning, like it's kind of been stopped up. So I, uh, so I uh, went in the back and picked it, and I got the two biggest and nastiest booger, boogers I've ever seen. They're the type that, like, they're hard at the top, and then, like, if you pull them, it's just like a string of snot. Oh my gosh, it, it was the grossest thing, but it felt so good because I could just, like, feel it. Like, you could almost feel it in the back of my throat. It was so long. And, like, pulled it and, like, kind of hung there. Uh, it was... It was gross, but it was amazing because it made my nose feel so much better. So, I'm going to enjoy my lemon loaf and my vanilla latte. Iced vanilla latte, that is. So, yep. Would you like to join me? Get out of here. That's what Gibson does whenever he's tired. I'm literally, I'm about to drop. I'm about to fall asleep right now. But, just got off work and I'm going home to see Jacqueline and Gibson for just a few minutes because Jacqueline has to go into work for some reason today. Uh, but anyways, I'm tired. And I hope to take a nap. Hopefully Gibson will be cooperative while Dad Dad tries to take a nap. And maybe he will take a nap as well. Um, I have a meeting tonight I have to go to, so really that's all that's on the agenda. And I have church. And I have to do the music for the church. So, uh... That's what's going on. I may not get to do much uh, blogging today, so I apologize for that, because I know you guys are just so interested in what I have to say. So, um, I do apologize. But I promise, tomorrow and the following few days, I'm going to have some good vlogs. I'm not going to lie. So, uh, just keep that in mind for today, okay? Thanks. Yeah. Yep, cornfields. Welcome to Illinois. 
I just got home maybe 20 minutes ago. I had time to see Jacqueline for possibly um, maybe five minutes. And she literally pulled out of her motherly bag of tricks. Derek, no vlogging. You have to take a nap. So I says to her, Oh yeah, Jacqueline? You think you're gonna act like my mother? And I said, Fine! Maybe I don't want to take a nap. Maybe I want to be tired. I am pretty tired, though. But I don't want to take a nap! I don't want to take a nap! <laughs> You guys wanna see the cutest little napping baby ever? He's so cute. He was he was uh struggling and giving me a little bit of hassle, but I finally got him to sleep. Check this out. And he shimmied his way all the way <laughs> over. Um look at this. And he does the cutest little thing. Anyway, so I guess while he's asleep, I'm going to take a nap too. So, I bid thee farewell. Good night. I don't know what your favorite snack is, but used to, mine used to be Twizzlers. But red vines are so much better. Red vines are where it is. Which brings up the song that's been going through my head all day. Uh, I think it's Aretha Franklin. Respect. R-E-S-P-E-C-T. But when we get to the part where it's like, Suck it to me, suck it to me, suck it to me, suck it to me. That part. What does she mean? Like, punch the respect in the face? Like, or the disrespecters? Because if that's what she wants, I'll give it to her. I'll give her a punch with Dennis the, the Menace. And I'll give her one with K-9 the Crippler. If you know what I mean? So. Oh man, red vines are amazing. I need to fall asleep. I'm sorry. Hey, you bunch of trash stashes. I really didn't think I was going to vlog very, or vlog whatever you call it very much today. I'm still so tired. And I'm driving, I'm in Jacqueline's car now, which is four-wheel drive, which is a lot of fun in the snow. <laughs> Anyways, um, I just wanted you to know, I'm sorry that this vlog is late. I am actually on the way to the meeting right now, which is why it's going to be late. Because I won't get home until like 10-ish, and, um, uh, and it'll, I have to be up at 4 to go to work. So, uh, I won't post it until I get home tomorrow, so I'm sorry. But, um, I promise that I will make it up. So, you guys have a great day. Alright? Bye. 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 <laughs> Bye. Bye. Uh... Yeah. 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 I'm gonna go home and jump in my bed. I'm gonna lay down and put down my head. I'm gonna put my PJs on and I have sweet dreams. Then in the morning I wake up and get some mellow cream. What you got going now? I in the play this uh I'll never make it as a rapper!